damn gasket. Look at him. I already got a new headset. They knew he was. They knew he was gonna be yelling. Get me another headset, goddamn it. How are we up by five? It's Michigan. Any team can be beat. Okay, yeah, any time. Michigan trailing by five at the Alabama 40 yard line. Hassan Haskins. And only two yards there is Anthony Jennings, who was the first guy to get a piece of him as they had a tight end, Sean McEwen, trying to block him. Great job by Anthony Jennings. And so what, he's been an unsung hero for this defense. They have had their fair share of issues this year. Both against the run and occasionally through the air, but Anthony Jennings has been a reliable piece and has been the team captain as a result. Alabama leading by five, trying to get to 11 wins for the ninth straight year, which would be the longest ever. AP poll era. Michigan trying to get win number 10 for the fourth time in five years. Patterson out of design. There you go, Patterson. Lowers the shoulder with Josh Job, the corner, preparing to drill him, and it's a gain of about nine. Nice run by Shane Patterson. Mix it up, keep this defense guessing. That's how you keep these defenses off balance. You can't keep doing the same shit on offense. Go for it, even if they were stopped. So don't be shocked either. I'm surprised Alabama only got don't got no um third third down conversions. Instead, they hand it off, and it's going to be close here. Thought Haskins. I think they got it. Was enough, and it looks like it will be a first down. Keep in mind, too, that at the end of the first half, Quinn Nordine made a 57-yard field goal, which tied a Michigan record. The first set of downs for the Wolverines at the 30-yard line. Greg, this has been the trouble zone for this Michigan offense. This is where they've stalled. They've they have to stall, man. With a touchdown on a field, field goal or at least a touchdown. Patterson back to throw. Everybody covered now. Oh. And Charbonnet with a heads up play. It was a little outside. close. Lee, true freshman. Hold on to the damn ball. As he was dragging down Patterson, it is a 13 yard loss. But for the most part, Charbonnet. You gotta get rid of that. You don't see nobody. Today. However, this time, Shane Lee is able to beat him to the inside. Shea Patterson with only one hand on the football there. It looked as though it got dislodged. and Heads up play by Charbonnet after struggling there at protection to hop on the football to preserve second down. You better be glad he held on to that ball. Did you see Patterson? He was trying to hold on. He was trying to hold on to it. He slipped out of his damn hand. That, that didn't work so well. He was trying to hold him to, from going back to that loose football. Worked enough, I guess. Charbonnet came up with a ball. Now Patterson. Oh, shit. Xavier McKinney bearing down on the receiver, Ronnie Bell. And Bell. Man, a hit stick on him. Maybe here in the footsteps. Accurate throw from Patterson on the RPO, and that was without question because of the footsteps. And some T-Rex arms there over the middle. Be careful, Xavier McKinney, to make sure he doesn't launch towards the header neck area. Obviously, that's a defenseless player, but I don't think he launched. There didn't look like an indicator there, Dave Kataya, as he went to initiate the contact. I agree. Patterson passing to down third down, four of eight. But this is third and 23. Can they get enough to give the field goal kicker a chance? They dump it off to Jackson. He gets to the 40. Sertan on the tackle. You're looking at a 58 or 59 yard field goal try. It's four down at about 20. They also just punt the ball. Yeah, you got to punt. And at the end of the half, to try one from here is one thing because yeah. if it's short or if it's no good, no problem. End of half. But if you try. He got one earlier, though, but I don't think they're going to let him kick it. With great field position. So I agree if he if he had that sack, they probably could have, you know, at least got a field goal. If that sack really put him out of out of um touchdown, um getting a touchdown. The punter Waddle waving for it, and he's got it at the Alabama nine-yard line. Early fourth quarter, Bama by five. 